All right. All right, all right, all right, all right. How do I look? How do I look? Mic check, one, two, three. All right, everything looks good. All right. I'm making this video because I'm going to be receiving electroconvulsive therapy, aka electroshock therapy soon. And I just want to remind myself of a few things. So this is for me. Um, your parents' names are Anna, Maria, Montez, Arellano. Your father's name is Tommy Madrigal Arellano, Sr. You have two sisters. Their names are Anita Arellano and Lydia Arellano. Um, your grandmother, your grandparents, your grandparents are uh, your mother's parents, your maternal grandparents, your maternal grandfather's dead. He died of cancer. He, uh, out of prostate cancer, I think. It's spread all over his body. Um, your maternal grandmother's name, your maternal grandfather was... What was his name? <laughs> Eleuterio. Yes, that's what his name was. Your maternal grandmother's name is Rosario Manjares. And she lives in Mexicali, Baja California, Mexico. In Colonia Alamitos, Republica de Chile. This is so you don't forget after you get electroconvulsive therapy and you're going, it's time to go back to visit your grandmother. She lives in the, the Colonia Alamitos, and the street is called Republica de Chile in Mexicali, Baja California, Mexico. You have an uncle. You have an uncle. You have three uncles. You have more than three uncles. But the ones you talk to, his name is Alfonso Montes. He lives in Shadow Hills, California. And, uh, hold on. These numbers. Crap. Hold, on. Hold on, I'll be right back. <laughs> this is crazy. All right. This is in preparation for the uh, post electroconvulsive therapy um, memory update. Just in case I lose everyone. All right, your uncle who lives in California, your link is uh, Alfonso Montes, and he lives in Shadow Hills, Shadow Hills, California, 41298 Hanover Street, 92203, Indio, California. All right. If you need to call him, his name is 760, his number is 760-250-4977. Jessica's number, your cousin, is 760-989-9116. I'm not sure if that's still her number. My aunt's number is 760-899-7170. And I also have an aunt in Reno, Nevada, Aunt Carolina. Carolina, 775-376. 6994. Alright. My mother's number so far right now is 419-975-2724. I believe it is. Alright. This is for your post electroconvulsive therapy memory. Um, a lot of things you have to remind yourself. Oh yeah, and you have two sons. I have two sons. Um, they are. Their names are Lestat, Sebastian, Arellano, 
and Sven Aragorn Aralana. They live in Ashland, in Ashland County, Ohio, the United States of America. You have dual citizenship in Mexico and in the United States. Your mother was a physics professor. Um, she has her bachelor's and master's degree at the Autonomous University of Baja California, Mexico. Um, you had, I had ECT, you had, I had ECT because of the, uh, the voices, they wouldn't stop. Um, so I needed some kind of, uh, you know, rebooting in my electrical system or something. I don't know, maybe it kills all of those circuits. Um, whatever. Hopefully it works. And hopefully it doesn't fuck up my memory too, but too much. Um, what else? Uh, it's been six minutes. Um, important things you need to know. Um, you live at 128 Perry Street, apartment 1010. Um, your name is Tommy Madrigal Arellano Jr. Um, you've been divorced for a couple of years now. There is still a restraining order in place until July 24, 2014. You can't see your children until then, or speak to your ex-wife. Um, what else? Um, mm, oh. Yeah, um... January is my grandmother's birthday, so I'm going to be visiting her, hopefully, if I regroup, if I get my memory back together. Um, I'm not sure. I've never done this electroconvulsive therapy. I've never received it before, so I don't know how it'll affect my memory. I'm not exactly sure how much damage it will cause. I'm sure it will cause some damage, hopefully in the right places because there are some things I really don't want to remember. Um, but I'm not sure how it'll affect me, the electroconvulsive therapy. Um, so I'll make another video later, um, because there's a lot more things I have to remember.